Oh y'all, let me get this vlog started, okay? Um, all right, happy Saturday. Um, it's a lot going on, y'all. I feel crazy. I feel like it's a glare, or am I tripping? I don't know. Is it something on my phone? I don't know. Anyway, happy Saturday, y'all. Um, it's your girl Monique Dior. Y'all, as y'all can tell, I am not in my right mind. I'm not focused. I, I'm all over the place right now at this point, honestly. Um, so today is uh, this week's video will be me attending the calendar reveal and dinner with uh, Arita LaShawn and also a content day. So I'm gonna kick it to the intro and it will be. calendar reveal for the 2024 calendar with Arita LaShawn. I'm excited because we done had several photo shoots throughout the year and um, I don't know if those pictures are going to be in the calendar or which pictures are going to be in the calendar but I know it's going to be dope so I'm super excited. Um, ready to see the final product. You know we haven't really seen much or many of the pictures that we've been taking. She's been holding them in. Um, so yeah today we're gonna have dinner and we are going to look at the calendar um together and then after that we're gonna create content y'all let me tell y'all something oh my god it was almost a whole five car wreck jesus and y'all would have seen it all on the vlog lord okay anyway so um y'all know i work a second job and I'm really praying and asking God to move um, within my first job so that I won't have to work my second job because honestly working the second job, it hinders me from doing a lot. Um, it's so much stuff coming up or so much stuff that I need to do or I would like to do, but I can't do it because I'm always at work. Um, so let me tell y'all about today so i had requested to be off but um when i was going back through it i seen it and i was like oh no i don't need this day off i need this day off in september so i scratched it out for august and i did it for um september and i was looking at it when the schedule came out and i looked at it and i said oh snap i made a mistake so i told my supervisor i'm like hey um I'm not going to be able to come to um, work Saturday because I wrote the wrong day. I know it's my fault, blah, 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 So basically she was like, no, I asked her, could I come in and work the morning and be off that night? Cause they had me scheduled to close the store. And so, um, she was like, no, um, that's not going to happen. I said, well, I'm not coming to work at all Saturday. If I can't work the morning and then be off the night, I'm not coming to work. And so then she was like, well, if you don't come to work, you can get written up. I said, where's the paper? Let me sign. Because I'm not missing my event. And so she's real nervous. And she, she really be scared. And every time I say something to her, she think I'm about to quit. Because I told her, I'm like, I'm not going to be here forever. She want me to move up in the store and in the company. And I'm like, nah, fam. Like, this ain't, this ain't my calling. This ain't what I'm supposed to do. This just, you know, a little, a little temporary, a little, mm, you know, help me with bills or whatever. So anytime I said something to her, she be thinking I'm gonna quit. So when I told her, I was like, well, I'm not coming. If you write me up, give me the paper, I sign it, whatever, I'm not coming. So she was, you know, she was distraught, a little nervous or whatever. Okay, I don't care. Um, so then she hit me up yesterday and she was like, hey, um, I did some long hard thinking and um, let's just say you work 12 to five and then um, I'll close uh, 
Saturday night. I said, okay, cool. That's fine. I mean, either she was going to work all day or I worked the morning and she closed at night. Those are your two options. Pick one. Whichever one works best for you, do it. But I know that I was not closing the store tonight. So I told her, I said, yeah, that's fine. Went in there. And so that's why I am up and I am out and about right now because I just got off work. So now I'm finna fly home, try and throw my bag together um, and get ready for this dinner and photo shoot, well, content day. But I'm gonna make it a photo shoot because we got like several rooms. Baby, I'm finna crank out some content today, whether I want to or not. I'm finna crank it out because I am getting low on content and it's time for me to spend a day to just doing content again. But, you know, by me working two jobs, Monday through Friday, by the time Sunday come, if I don't have to work my other job, I'll be ready to take a nap or sleep. And that's what I did this morning. I kind of slept in a little bit. Oh, Lord, I ain't used my hand sanitizer when I got in the car. Jesus. That's one of my rituals. As soon as I get off work, I use hand sanitizer because, you know, I feel a little money and stuff. But whatever. Um, I am now home. I am about to start getting ready because I think my GPS said I need to leave the house by 6.50. Um, in order to make it to the place on time. So that's what I'm about to do. I need to find me a snack. I know we are eating at the thing, but um, I'm hungry now. I ain't ate all day. So I need a little snacky snack to help me get through. But yeah, put my phone on the charger and start to get ready. Later, y'all. Y'all, I'm supposed to be walking out the door, but as you can see, I'm in here playing with wigs and still packing my bag. I ain't even dressed yet. Say a prayer for me, y'all. I'm gonna be on time to something one day. Just one day. But today just ain't that day. So let me pack this bag and get on the Okay, right. y'all. Per usual. I am late. But I am cute. But I'm late. Um. So I was going to do a full face of makeup, but then I couldn't get my eyebrows for uh, my eyebrows to look like cousins. So I went and I wiped my whole face off. So I only did eyeshadow, lashes, and lip gloss. Um, oh, I need to go with them. Oh, they having a party. Okay. Anyways, um, so yeah, that's what took up a lot of my time, me wiping it off, um, and just saying forget it. So by that time, time had passed. I was doing good, but when it came to me picking out clothes for the content, that's where I messed up at. Y'all, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I've never been the stylish girl. Like, that's never been me. Um, I'm a sundress kind of girl. Give me a sundress and some flip-flops. I'm good. <sighs> so, trying to find something to match or that wouldn't clash with the themes of the room was kind of my task and kind of where I got lost with time but um i'm on my way uh ain't nobody said nothing in the group yet so i don't know but my bag in the back seat i'm dressed and i'm ready to hang out with the girls uh hopefully i ain't too too late to where i miss everything hopefully they wait on me Atlanta or being in Atlanta 
So, yeah, hopefully it's a smooth ride for me, but we gonna see. And as y'all can see, I am sliding and gliding, okay? I play no games with these roads. And I'm feeling good because I don't have the GPS. I ain't gotta do GPS until I get on the baby pick a lane. I don't have to do the um GPS until I get on the interstate. So that's it, that's all. Alright, y'all. I'm done talking y'all to death until later. Alright, y'all. So I'm here, but I just realized that I left my tripod and I left my little remote control. Great. <laughs> but I made it here. Um, police is out. But, you know, I was sliding. But, you know, got my ways on. I got my eyes open. So, luckily I made it here. Beat the time on the thing. But, let's get inside and celebrate, y'all. I'm late. Pray for me. Atlanta is so pretty at night like look at all the lights <laughs> all the lights in the big buildings continue straight lady hush I know where I'm going now all right y'all you can't see me y'all see me 
do hair hoodies. Um, sure, so you're saying, man. All right, so, um, all right, the shoot and the reveal is over, y'all. The calendars are so dope. Oh my goodness, I wish I could have get got pictures and footage for y'all, but you know, we signed an NDA, so we can't. We can't, we can't, we can't get no tea on it. But what I will say is that the calendars will be available to purchase November the 4th. Y'all know I got my show, uh, BBP Circus Freaks, November the 4th. Y'all be there, be square. It's going down. Um, the pictures will be released. The calendars will be released from all the shoots that we did this year. Dope, 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 dope content. Um, so that was a smart idea. We went to a uh, girl mob museum. Um, basically, somebody rented out an apartment and turned it into uh, uh, like a selfie museum. Basically, like a little content apartment. And, you know, you just rent it out, shoot your content, and go on about your business. And each wall kind of was like a different... Police reported ahead. Thank you. Um, each wall was like a different scene. So, you know, I switched my hair, I switched my clothes. Um, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I'm mad that I left my tripod and my, um, uh, my remote at home. Um, cause you know, I would've took 50, 11 million pictures. Um, but... You know, I had to wait on the other girls, you know, help them take their pictures. Then they helped me take my pictures. So, uh, uh, um, oh, now we slowing down. What's going on here? Um, and I can vlog and drive because I'm on the interstate and I know where I'm going and I'm looking at the road. Um, what else? Yeah, I just really wish I had my tripod because it would have made stuff a lot easier and faster for me. Um, I don't know if I'm going to post all of that content um, because y'all know me. I'm super, super duper duper uh, hard on myself and I'm my own worst critic. Ooh, what happened there? Um, I'm my own worst critic, so <sighs> I don't like a lot of my pictures. Um, not too much of a fan of how my eyeshadow came out. Um, oh, it was a bad wreck. Aha. Jesus. Ten cars over there. Thank you, Lord. All right. Um, I pray that they're safe. Glad I'm not in an accident, but God, I pray that they're safe. Um, what else? Yeah, so I was going through the pictures, and yes, I've already deleted a bunch of them because I don't like the way they look. Um, yeah. So, I'm going to have to pick another day or another day that I'm off and just get content, content, content. Because my content running low, y'all. I ain't got much to post. So, I done caught up. Usually, I, at, first, at one time, I was months behind as far as like posting content because I was always doing something. But, you know, now things are slowed up, content are slowed up. So I have to make it my business to pick a day to sit down and just do content. So that's it. That's y'all. That, that, I can't talk. That's it. That's all. Um, if you are in the Georgia area, September the 17th, get your tickets to come to the Resilient Show. Um, that show's going to be really good. I'm walking in it. And the rest of the ladies from um, Rita LaShawn is walking in it. Um, get your tickets for BBP Oasis. Uh, I'm talking about Oasis Dream. That was last year. BBP Circus Freaks. Um, that show is November 4th. Tickets go on sale for that Monday. Calendars will be available for you to purchase for the 2024 year. Um, what else? I think that's it. That's it. That's all. All right. Thank y'all so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Be sure to tell a friend or tell Tim that Monique Dior has done it again. I don't know what y'all gonna watch next week, but it's gonna be something. I got y'all. I promise.
All right, I'm gonna get off this phone because police is policing tonight, okay? And I don't need no ticket because Georgia, they be tripping about, you know, being on your phone. Although I ain't touching it, they still be tripping. So, all right, y'all, thank y'all so much for all the support, the love. Until next week, y'all be safe. COVID is coming back around. Well, they ain't really never left, but make sure y'all wash your hands, wear your mask, all that good stuff. Love y'all. Later.